Okay, hopefully they're starting. Um, I'm back doing another one of these Emacs is great episodes. So I want to go and something that last time was bugging me that let's start. Um, get back into our. Now, if we remember how we were doing this, um, we have to run, when we make a change, um, org tangle, org, mm, fat fingers, org tangle. Yeah, so it's org babble tangle. Yeah, and that will um, output our code here into uh, the EL file. Now that's going to be annoying to run every time. So the solution on how to do this is I remember seeing somewhere else. I, I don't, I can't find it now. Was to do it in using local variables, and it was to use local variables in a directory locals. But you can also do something called file local variables. Now let's see if we can find out about this function of local variables. So we're going to get some help on a function, add a file, I think it's by a local variable. Okay. And this is going to add a local variable for us to our file and when we refresh the buffer it will hit it will run those variables add them just to the file so what we can do here is we can add a hook that's going to run our file but let's see let's see how this works first so let's go back so let's add add file local variable and uh, let's just call it my pool and there's and what's the value for my fuel is going to be bar and you see it added these comments at the end here for local variables and now let's reload the buffer reload, re, revert buffer sorry uh, yep and I forgot to save it. So let's try that again. My full bar. Okay. And now we can do revert. And it's going to ask us if we want to let these variables be marked as safe. And we do. So we'll do the exclamation point. Ah, put it inside this thing. So it was here before. So let's try and run that. And I can see what my foo evaluates to. And it evaluates the bar. Now, there's also, uh, if you see, there's, there's also, you see sometimes there's that you can put the local variables here on the top. But I'm not going to do that. That's for another time. You can look out and do that. This one, I think, this way is cleaner. And we can also do something here. You can put it. The local area. Now we can hide it out of the way later. Okay. Now, I think something's going on with the music. It seems very fast. Yeah. Where are we? Okay. Um, now, what we can also have here is we have an eval. So, do eval, and we can do a local variable. Let's try message. Uh, yep, and this is going to be save it, revert the buffer. Yes, and it's going to ask if we want to allow these. 
And here you can see um, in the mini buffer that it said, let's go back to messages. If you see messages, here it printed out local variable. Okay, so how can we handle this? Is we can add a hook for our for our um, when we save the file that it will export it that it will run org babel the org babel tangle for us so let's see how do we do that where did I find where did I put that where did I put that code And I will add this for you here just in a second. Mm, oh, now I can't find it. Okay, so let's try it here. No, oh, well, let me put. Uh, it looks like I might have to fat finger this one too. Very strange. Okay, so I'm gonna have to. I'm going to. It looks like I'm gonna have to fat finger it. Maybe let's try it here. Oh, it did paste. For some reason, it didn't update the thing. Very strange. Oh, and it did. It just took a long time. <laughs> so, let's get rid of this. And let's try it again. Now, we went, to, we went to add a hook. That's going to be after save hook. And it's going to run a lambda function. So, what that is, is just a anonymous function. Maybe another time we'll get into what actually is. So we're adding a hook. So after save hook, whenever we save a file, we're going to run this anonymous function, which is going to run org babble tangle. And these are some other parameters that go along with adding hook. So let's just take a look at what, what add hook is supposed to give us. Okay. Yep. So So we can see here that the add hook takes a takes two functions, and the other one is append. Let's see what append does. So append is going to add at the end. Local is going to just add it to the local buffer value. So that means that only on this buffer is it going to be run. Okay, so. Let's go out of here. Let's save this and let's revert buffer. Yep. And it's gonna ask us again, do we wanna do we wanna run this? And we wanna say yes, we are happy with this. And right, now let's try just putting menu bar mode back. Yeah. And just gonna save it this time. And this time you see in the in the messages that it says that it tangled one code block. And if we go and we open up our init.org, init.el, sorry, we'll see that menu barred mode is one. Right? Great. I'm happy with that. Let's kill this. Okay, let's put this back to turning this stupid menu bar mode off. Near, I'll say that again, it tangled the buffer for us. And let's do something else here. So if we add here, I think it's comment. Comment. It won't export it, I think, if I'm right. Eh, well, I'll save that for another time. Okay, now uh, I'm gonna need to add this back into Git. And 
so the next thing I want to do here, I'm going to add myself a to-do. I'm going to get into more to-dos, but what can you do next is I want to install Maggit. You know, and well, there was something else that I wanted to install quickly that will help us. Uh, let's just, Maggit's probably the most important thing for next. So that's going to be next time is installing Maggit. Oh, before I Maggit, I need to install packages. And for that, we're going to use this package. Might do another one. Show you how to make that. Uh, another one, maybe. Very good. And other demos, demo types. Right, stuff. Stuff. Maybe I should also get a uh, fly spell inside. A float, fly, fly. Fly spell, which is a spell checker. Okay, so that's it. Let's get out of here. Um, yes, we want to save. No, I test the org. Okay, now let's get uh, get add patch. Yep, we want to save this hunk, and we want to do get commit adding. Let's get push. And there you go. So take a look at this. Um, try using these uh, local variables. Um, see how it works for you. Also, um, what was I going to say? Uh, if you see anything that I'm not doing right, Feel free to put make a comment, make a pull request, leave me better so I can get this fixed. And I need to stop this recording now if I can find. Okay, call to.